Welcome to Learn Haitian Creole. This video was requested by someone who is actually in the process of adopting from Haiti. So I'm hoping others can learn from it as well. Did something hurt your feelings or did something hurt you? Est-ce que y a un bagaille qui fait mal? Est-ce que y a un bagaille qui fait mal? Are you hurt? Est-ce que blessé? Blessé is also a cut. If someone has a cut and there's blood, blessé. But if someone's hurt, you can also use blessé. Do you feel okay? Est-ce que senti ou bien? Est-ce que ou senti ou bien? Est-ce que ou senti ou bien? Is something wrong? Est-ce que ou gain yon bagay? Est-ce que ou gain yon bagay? Which translates to do you have something? Is something wrong? To ask someone if something's wrong, you can always say, Ki sa ou gain? Ki sa ou gain? Which translates to what do you have? Ki sa ou gain? Do you need to poop? Est-ce que ou besoin poupou est-ce ou besoin poupou or you can replace poupou with tata the most common way to ask someone if they have to poop is to ask est-ce ou gain poupou est-ce ou gain poupou do you have to poop do you have poop do you need to pee now, there are two ways to say this one. You can say, Est-ce ou besoin pipi? Est-ce ou besoin pipi? Or you can say, Est-ce ou besoin fait pipi? Est-ce ou besoin fait pipi? The most common way to ask someone if they have to pee is to ask, est-ce que ou gen pipi? Est-ce que ou gen pipi? Est-ce que ou gen pipi? Do you feel like throwing up? Est-ce que ou envie vomi? Est-ce que ou envie vomi? Est-ce que ou envie vomi? This medicine will make you feel better. Medicament ça a fait sentir pi bien. Medicaments ça a fait sentir pi bien. Or instead of medicament, we can say remed. Remed. Remed ça a fait sentir pi bien. Remed ça a fait sentir pi bien. Let's practice this together. An pratique, or you can say an nou pratique. Okay, an pratique. Sa ansam. This is our church. Sa se l'église nou. Sa se l'église nou. Or you can say, Sa se l'église nou ma chère. Sa se l'église nou ma chère. So it kind of means you just go there. You're a member. You don't own the church. This is your Sunday school class. Sa se classe l'école dimanche ou. Sa se classe l'école dimanche ou. Mommy and daddy will stay right here with you. Mama ak papa aprete la avec ou. Mama ak papa aprete la avec ou. Or you can say, Mama ak papa aprete la avec. Replace avec with ave. Mama ak papa aprete la avec. Did you have a bad dream? Est-ce que ou te fait yon mauvais rêve? Est-ce que ou te fait yon mauvais rêve? So the word mauvais has more than one meaning in Creole. 
Um, in this case, we used it for bad, but you can use it for someone who, who has a mean look on their face. They look upset. You can say the person is move. And sometimes if someone is very strict um, and rough, people will refer to them as move. Like sometimes they refer to a lot of dads as move because they're so jealous. You can also use the word move to describe the ocean. So if you were to say la mer, la mer, which is the ocean, la mer a move, it means the ocean is rough. It's too dangerous to go in there. Did you have a nightmare? Est-ce que ou t'es fait yon cauchemar? Est-ce que ou t'es fait yon cauchemar? Here's a snack for you. Mais yon ti fri dodoy. Mais yon ti fri dodoy. I should point out that this is not a word you would use to give your kids food because in Haiti it's viewed as something that's not healthy, like potato chips. You would pretty much say, here's your apple or here's your banana. What kind of food do you like the most? Ki kalite manje ou pi reme? Ki kalite manje ou pi reme? You can also replace the word qualité, which means quality, with qui jan, what kind. Qui jan de manger ou pi reme. Qui jan de manger ou pi reme. I will braid your hair. Map trisse cheve ou. Cheve is hair. Map trisse is braid cheve ou. Map trisse cheve ou. It's time to eat breakfast. Lile, le is time. Pou manger, manger matin. Morning food. Lile, pou manger, manger matin. You can also say lile, pou manger, déjeuner. Déjeuner is like saying breakfast because jeuner is too fast. So déjeuner is to break the fast. Lile, pou manger, déjeuner. It's time to eat dinner. Lile pour manger dîner. Lile pour manger dîner. It's time for supper. Lile pour souper. Lile pour souper. Notice I did breakfast, dinner, and supper instead of breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So in Haiti, it's breakfast, dinner, and supper. Show me where it hurts. Montrem or montrem-moi qui côté li fait ou mal. Montrem qui côté li fait ou mal. Please buckle your seat belt. Tant pis, which is please. Tache sentiu. Tant pis. Tache sentiu. Please put your cup in the sink. Tant pis. Mette godeu na evier. Mette godeu na evier. I to break this sentence up because a lot of the words look different. They they're new. So tant pis is please. Mette is to put. Gode is cup. Evier is sink. Please put your plate in the sink. Tant pis, mettez assiette ou na evier. Mettez assiette ou na evier. Assiette is plate. These will be our family rules. Sayo se règlement famino. Sayo se règlement famino. Which one is your favorite? Qui est ou pireme? So, qui est ou pireme translates more to which one do you like the most? Qui est ou pireme? Which one do you like best? Again, same meaning. 
qui est ou pi reme? Qui est ou pi reme? So it pretty much ask which one do you like the most? Is that comfortable? Est-ce que ça confortable? Est-ce que ça confortable? Est-ce que ça confortable? Let's try it together. An or anu, okay? An eseyeli asam. An eseyel asam. Don't be afraid. Piga upe. Piga upe. Or you can say upa besoin pe. Ou pas besoin pe, which translates to, you don't need to be afraid. We will help you. Nap, or nu ap, okay? Nap e deu. Nap e deu. Please turn off the light. Tant pri, e ten, e ten is to turn off. E ten limiere. Tant pri, e ten limiere. We also use the word a ten for a fire. So if you wanted to turn off the stove, you wouldn't say feme, which means close. You would say a ten difea. So turn off the fire. Please turn on the light. Tampri lime limiere. Lime is to turn on. Instead of uve, which is open. Tampri lime limiere. Thank you for watching this video. Um, I hope you were able to add new words to your vocabulary. I hope this helps um, the person who requested it and other people. And as always, if you have any questions or if something was not clear, if you are confused about anything, do not hesitate to reach out to me. Thank you. Merci.